Hello, my name is Martin and this is 3D Printing Iceland. Today I'm going to show you a 3D model I printed out and painted of an area called uh, Öravajökull and that's a part of Vatnajökull glacier. But let's have a look after the intro. So this area is uh, the place in Iceland where uh, the largest mountain is. Here is uh, Kvannadalsnjúkur, that's the uh, highest peak of Iceland. It's uh, 2110 meters in height and this uh, peak is uh, popular uh, to go hiking uh, up the mountain and up to the glacier and up on the, on the top and there are quite a number of routes uh, to the top but uh, the most popular ones are either from here uh, and that's not very steep inclined up this mountain and up the glacier. Uh, another popular one is, is going uh, over here but that's more steeper climb and, uh, but uh, it is taking uh, like 20 hours from start to finish to go uh, hiking up on the top and back down so it's a quite a quite a trip also there are several like climbing routes uh, for like uh, very trained uh, professionals that go on top of those ridges uh, on the on the mountainside here and and they uh, they have several routes uh, in this uh, location Mm -hmm. that are suited for climbers. Uh, this glacier here is, is called Öravíjökull and uh, this whole area is uh, part of Vatnajökull. That's the uh, biggest glacier in, in Iceland. And here in uh, this, uh, uh, this place, this is uh, basically a very big volcano. And this volcano has erupted uh, two times in the last thousand years and it's probably getting ready to erupt in not very far future. Uh, uh, we have seen signs of the ice is starting to melt in the middle of the crater and that indicates there is some geothermal activity going on and there have been uh, quite numerous uh, earthquakes in the area that should indicate something is, is going on. So at some point of time uh, we will have an eruption here and it can be a very powerful uh, eruption. Last time it erupted, uh, all the farms in the area that are around the mountain uh, got uh, destroyed and people had to uh, move And because the farms are a very short distance from the volcano. They only have like half an hour if the eruption starts to, to evacuate. And this area is, is uh, also very popular by tourists and there are not many people that live here but uh, there are a lot of tourists around the area. So now when the scientists have uh, thought the volcano might erupt, they are organizing evacuation plans in the area and, and that uh, some people might have just 15 minutes uh, to evacuate. And, but uh, they have pointed out some locations around the area that should be safe if they have a flood. Uh, because if the volcano erupts under the glacier, there will be a, a flood coming down the, the sides. And most likely it will go down here, this route. And there's no farms uh, in this area. So that's the most safe route. But if it goes down here, there are several farms uh, in this area here. So. That would be a worst case scenario if it com comes down here. But uh, this is a model. I, I printed this out last night and, and painted this today after work. And, uh, I decided to paint uh, the road on the on the on the model, even though uh, the scale of the the road is incorrect. The it's not that wide in in reality but that was the smallest pencil I had to create the road and I'm not sure if it's a good idea to have a, a man-made structure uh, uh, at those landscape prints I'm doing but I, I decided to try it out and, and see how it goes. 
but uh, this mountain is is, is very uh, beautiful to watch from the from the coastline and from the road uh, a bit more far, farther away and it's uh, a beautiful mountain and this area is very popular by tourists also going hiking and even though people are not going up in the glacier they're hiking around the area so this is uh, the printer date um, I hope you like this one uh, let's watch a time lapse of the print and, and paint and I'll get back to you
So this was my video on this 3D printed landscape model of the area uh, Öravajökull and Kvarnadalsnjúkur, the highest peak in Iceland. Uh, I hope you liked the video and I'll see you in the next one.